Yeah, it would be good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Dobar dan svima, hvala vam što ste došli. Ja sam Sara Kekuš iz Centra za mirovne sudije. Svjetski dan izbjeglica podsjetnik je svima nama da ovo društvo možemo učiniti otvorenijim, solidarnijim i inkluzivnijim. Upravo zato danas se nalazimo ispred vlade Republike Hrvatske kako bismo podsjetili da iako je naše društvo solidarno, isto tako moraju biti i naše politike. Nažalost, politike Republike Hrvatske i dalje su upravo suprotne. Une su nasilja i kršenja ljudskih prava. Danas smo ovdje dakle sa filmskom ekipom Shadow Game-a, odnosno filma dokumentarnog igra Sjenki. Upravo kako bismo upozorili na važnost zaštite djece bez pratnje, a pogotovo djece bez pratnje u pokretu. Danas u 17 sati u Kulturno-informativnom centru u Preradovićevoj pet održat ćemo tribinu o djeci bez pratnje u Hrvatskoj, a nakon toga vas pozivamo da u 21 sati 30 svi dođete i pridružite nam se na ljetnoj pozornici Tuškanac na besplatnoj projekciji filma Igra Sjenki, na kojoj će isto tako dakle, sama filmska ekipa gostovati i razgovarati sa publikom nakon filma. I was 15 years old when I, uh, I was trying to cross uh, Croatia and to go to the Europe and uh, to get protection there because the Croatia they were not giving me asylum and they were not giving me uh, any kind of stay or something to stay here. Uh, and it was really difficult for me. Uh, I was only 15 years old and I tried like five, six times and I and I work in inside the Croatian jungle. Like uh, I passed river, mountains and other things like uh, seven to six days I work and once I work like 11 days inside Croatia and at the Slovenian border the, the police always they catch us and they while it, uh, they did violence with me and with other guys who was with us on one game. So please, I can say like, uh, start stay for refugees and treat all the humans uh, same in the same way like you are uh, treating the Ukrainians and other uh, children from the Europe. Please uh, treat all the children in the same way. Uh, two years old, I have been in Croatia uh, before. Now I'm in uh, Netherlands and they gave me asylum. Uh, with my brother. Jana, can you show your picture? Yes. With your student? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Maybe you can share that you lost your brother. Yeah, okay. I lost my brother in uh, Croatia, in the mountains. Uh, the police got here to take me, uh, push back in uh, Bosnia. And my brother is uh, here in Zagreb, over there. My brother Khatnar in Slovenia, from Slovenia Khatnar in Trieste, Italy. From Trieste to Netherlands, Khatnar with a uh, train. And he's uh, 15 years. Yeah. Happening on the shadow side of your country is really intolerable. Uh, I've been to the border area of Bosnia and Herzegovina and Croatia many times. Uh, that's where I met Jano and his brother. Uh, that's where I followed Eski. That's where I met many, many people in really, really difficult circumstances. Surviving in the cold, in small tents, in the snow, um, being pushed back. Not once, not twice, but up to 50 times, one of the boys in our film. Uh, Mustafa, who was actually tortured by 14 Croatian border guards. They broke his arm, they electrocuted him, uh, and they pushed him back 50 times. It's so your laws that you are actually violating, so please, start abiding by your own rules. And I think this is what we also are going to address in Croatian Parliament today. Um, it is the rules, and you just have to follow them. So please, do so. Um, and you can find our manifesto that we drafted with them on shadowgame.eu. Find out everything about it on our website, sign it, because you can do something to change this.